So, Bill, what do you plan on doing later? Just going over to Candy's. Don't really know what we're going to do. How about you? Ah, eh, nothing special. Just going to go over to Cassie's later and, you know, mess around. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet you mess around in more ways than one. <laughs> you lucky bastard. Well, don't act like you don't have a woman. Yeah, well, it's not like Candy shows the same hot passion Cassie does. If I were you, I'd spend more time on trying to get Candy to show that hot passion, rather than hanging out with Lepowski. <clears throat> yeah, well, I gotta keep trying. It's not like you're getting anywhere with her. What's up, ladies? Aren't we looking fine tonight? <clears throat> Whoa, no way! Whoa, no way! I never expected to see you guys here tonight. Uh, and you are? Ah, uh, Twig, you and Bill are always such jokesters. Uh, you're freaking us out here, bro. How do you know our names? You guys seriously don't remember me. Uh, are we supposed to? Well, yeah, dude. We only went to school together for like 80 years. We did? Oh, yeah. You were that short kid who was always trying to tag along with me and Bill. Yeah, but didn't you move away or something? Well, I did, but then my family moved back. So you'll be seeing a lot more of me. Well, it must be a lucky day then. <laughs> you got that right. So wait, what year did you move away? I forgot. Uh, middle of sixth grade. Really? That long ago? Yup, yup. Damn. Yeah. I mean, Bill, the last time I saw you, your voice was cracking like old paint. Really? Uh. I mean, seriously, I never heard a guy's voice crack that much. It was like every other word. <laughs> yes, puberty certainly wasn't kind to old Bill here. Wish I could have gotten some of the more classic moments on film. Good times, good times. Uh... <laughs> yeah, well go ahead and yuck it up. But I'm all man now. Just ask my girlfriend, Candy. Chill out, dude. I'm just pulling your chain. So you've got a girlfriend. Cool. How about you, Twig? Uh, yeah, why wouldn't I? I don't know how you guys can stand a steady girlfriend. I like being free, not chained down, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Who said having a girlfriend means I'm chained down? Well, you're just with one woman, right? Not at all. My girlfriend and I are free to hook up with whoever we want, whenever we want. I see. It doesn't mean we love each other any less. Quite the opposite, actually. Getting some variety keeps things hot between us. Sounds sweet, dude. I mean, I'm all about variety. So many women out there, you gotta try as many as you can. Well, if you're such a ladies' man, why don't you actually ask one of the girls you're standing with to go home with you? Dude, these are just my friends, but... I can get any girl I want. Just none of these are my type. All right, what about her? Yeah, what about her? Is she worthy of you? Look, just because these girls are my friends and that bitch over there is ugly does not mean I don't have skills when it comes to the ladies. Backpedal. I agree, there's nothing wrong with her. You just don't have the nerve to ask her out. No way, man, her? Seriously, she makes me flaccid.
glad that's over. Yeah, yeah. Didn't know I was in a band, did you? Flaccid, huh? Yeah, that's how I felt, listening to it. So you only score with women because you're in some band. That's not having skills. Look, asshole, I've got the skills to pay the bills, and the ladies know it. This guy's a putz. Fascinating. Twig, who is this fool? Hang on. Cassie. Hey, babe, I didn't expect to see you till tonight. Anything wrong? Ah, lucky bastard. Aww. Just that I simply couldn't wait to be with you until tonight. I want you now. Hot damn, Twig! Which one of the girls in your harem is this? I just happen to be his girlfriend. So for your information, I'm his head lady. In more ways than one. <laughs> hmm. Man, it's not fair. My, my. Cassie Branch. Nature has been good to you, if you know what I mean. Oh, that's Ked. We used to go to school with him or something. Then he moved away. Remember me now, beautiful? No, not really. Oh, but you have to remember Ked, baby. Yeah, he's unbelievably talented. He was just telling us about his pickup skills. Such as? Well, I'm a righteous pool player. I bet I could whoop anybody's ass at that. Wasn't your music enough? Well, rack him up, bitch. Whatever, I'll kick your ass in pool. Ha ha ha. Pissing contest. Oh, hello. Bill, I'm getting the douche vibe from you. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Alright, come on, let's go, dipshit. Alright, you guys have fun measuring your dicks. I'm going to have sex with my woman. Man, you're ready for your beatdown, aren't you? Let me just get my pool bat ready. Let's do this. Hi, Bill. Tuesday. Whoa. Back off. Yeah, well, I just got out of dance class, and I thought I'd drop by here on my way home. Well, you found me. And me. Shut up! Come on, don't be a dick. Ugh, fine. Tuesday, this is Ked. He went to school with us. Or some shit like that. And then I moved away. But now I'm back, baby, and better than ever. <laughs> well, pleased to meet you. And I, you. But why don't I remember going to school with you before you moved away? <sighs> oh, I didn't move here until 10th grade. That must be it, because I know I would have remembered somebody as beautiful as you. Ugh, give me a break. Thank you. Yeah, 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 introduction's over. Come on, Ked, let's play a game. My, my. Touchy, aren't we? Come on, Ked, let's play. So, after your pool game, do you want to maybe go out to eat somewhere and then to a movie? Oh, uh, man, we're supposed to hang out tonight? Tuesday, I got plans with Candy. Ha! Huh? Oh, brother. Shut up, dude. Uh, Tuesday. Oh. I see. <laughs> but we could get together sometime later this week. I'm free. I promise. Tool. Shut up. I happen to be free tonight. Ken, just take your shot already. Come on, let's play pool. Fine, 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 fine. Oh, you're in the middle of a game? Hey, Lepowski, watch this. You are good at pool. Uh, 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 Ked doesn't lie, baby. Whatever. Out of the way, amateur. Uh, uh, uh. uh, damn it! Hey, Bill, what can I say? You're a pro. A pro at sucking. <laughs> so, Tuesday, you're a dancer? Yes, she's a dancer. Why do you need to know? So, how long have you been dancing? Since I was three. Dancing's my life. Yeah, and I already knew that. She also wants to dance on Broadway someday. No shit. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's my dream at least. So, show us some of your Broadway moves. Won't it look kind of weird for me to dance in here when nobody else is? Eh, who cares? Yeah, come on, dance. I want to see. Good job, honey. Uh, you're on fire. Not bad. Not bad at all. Dancing's my true passion. Music's my passion. Wow, that's really cool. Uh, oh, I 
I'm trained in all kinds of dance, but tap is my real specialty. What's the name of your band? The Wankers. But it used to be Butterbun Shoehorns. We were drunk. Okay, that's the stupidest name I've ever heard. I think it's a really interesting name. Could we get back to the game? William, it's not polite to interrupt. And Tuesday was asking me about my band. Oh! How many other people are in your band? So my band's made up of Bope, Elle, and Randy. Uh, Randy's a girl. You have other girls in your band? Oh, well, they're just friends. Oh, of course. And besides, they wouldn't compare to you. You think I'm special? I do. Let me show you. At the end of the long work week, the people sigh and say, Thank God it's Friday and the weekend's on its way. But I just met an amazing girl who makes that saying out. No, no, now that she's in my life, it makes me want to shout. Hey. No one? Not even Bill? Ah, give me a break. Has written you a song before? I can't imagine why. <sighs> Your song was breathtaking. Thank you so much. It really means a lot. Anything for you, baby. Well, if you boys will excuse me, I'm gonna run to the restroom real quick. Be back soon. You know, you've got a lot of nerve. Now what? What do you think you're doing hitting on Tuesday like that? She's mine! Last I checked, your girlfriend's name was Candy. Not Tuesday. So I guess that means it's open season. Yeah, well think again, because Tuesday and I go way back. So if you know it's good for you, you'll back off. Whoa, 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 I can't help it if we made a connection through my music. Dude, connection my ass. Tuesday's an incredibly deep and complex person. So? So, some sappy love song isn't going to make you soulmates. What about sex? Oh my god, Tuesday's not ready for sex, dumbass. Don't you think if anyone would have hooked up with her by now, it would have been me? You? Do I get another choice? She's not a monkey. She likes to take things slow. She wants to be really serious with someone before she gets in bed. Well, don't get mad at me if I just happen to be the one who helps her take that step. She may be deep, and my serenade to her is guaranteed to take me deep inside of her. What? Ugh! Come on! Ugh! <laughs> Ugh! Let me show you just how good I am at pool. You're a tool. Please, please stop it. Why are you fighting? Well, because. Because I was defending your honor. Defending my honor? What are you talking about? Because that stupid song was just a ploy to get in your pants. Is that true, Ken? Well, not exactly, but... Maybe. Well, thanks for being honest with me, I guess. Forget him anyway, Tuesday. You know I'm the one who really cares about you. Oh yeah? Is that the truth? Come on, you know it is. Like how you cared enough to forget our plans tonight so you could go be with Candy? Just because Candy's my girlfriend doesn't mean I love you any less. I promise, when the time is right, you and I will be together forever. We're soulmates, Tuesday. Oh, please. Let me prove it. Bill Snorgensburg! Candy! Oh, boy! I come all the way down here to surprise my boyfriend, and what do I find? He's kissing her! But, but it's not what it looks like. Don't act like I didn't see what just happened. Don't expect any kisses from me tonight. You can just go ahead and be with your precious Lepowski. Tuesday, I'll call you later. I gotta work this out. Candy! So, there's pretty much no chance for me, huh? Look, Ken, I'm sorry, but... Nah, I'm just kidding. I was being kind of a schmuck, using my song to try to hook up with you. I hope we can be friends, at least. I'd like that. Awesome. Maybe you could dance for my band sometime. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Well, my parents are going to be coming to pick me up soon, so 
I'll talk to you later. Okay, have a good night, Kev. Cool. Aren't you going to go wait outside in the parking lot until your parents get here? Oh, here they come. <laughs> Well, see you later, Tuesday. Come on, ladies, let's go home. Did I just see what I think I saw? No, no, that's impossible. Isn't it? Did Ked really just leave in a spaceship? I mean, I've been taking my lithium regularly, haven't I? So, all that must have been my eyes playing tricks on me. I better go call my psychiatrist.